Hi, hope you're all well. I'm Viv and I'm the face behind Skin Farmer Aesthetics in Stockton on Tees in the UK. Uh, tonight, uh, myself and Dr. Sunny, Sunny Desi, we're continuing our weekly series of lives talking about ultrasound, using ultrasound in our aesthetics work. Um, hi Sunny, hope you're well. Uh, hi Stephen Harris, hope you're doing okay as well. Nice to uh, see you joining us tonight. Um, so tonight we're speaking to another specialist um, who uses ultrasound. She's a professor of radiology based in Morocco and it's Professor Mariam Idrissi who will hopefully be joining us soon. I will get Sunny to uh, join first. I won't be a second. Sorry about this. Um, but yeah, Mariam, she's um, based in Marrakesh, I think, in Morocco. And she's um, she's a professor of radi radiology. She does lots of work involving radiology. Should be hopefully joining us soon. Won't be a second. There we go. Right, so Sunny. Ah, how are you, Sunny? How are you doing? Hi, Viv. I'm good. How are you? Fine, yes, doing well, thanks. Um, I was just uh, mentioning there, we've got um, a professor of radiology uh, joining us tonight from Morocco, of all places, um, Doc, uh, Professor Mariam yeah. Idrissi. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. That's, uh, that's Mariam just joining now. So, yeah, no, yeah. If, she, if you want to add her. Oh, very exciting. And we've got some really exciting stuff, especially um, you've got some photos and videos of ultrasound scanning of um, skin lesions, which Mariam. Yeah. Good evening, uh, Mariam. Good evening. How are you guys? We're good. We're good. And how are you? Fine, fine. It's a not. It's a uh, honor for me to be with you. Oh my God! Oh. It says the professor. It says the professor. <laughs> <laughs> You you do some fantastic work, Mariam. I came across your work because of Carolina Mary Lewis yeah. in um, in uh, Argentina. I think you're both good friends. You get on together well. Is that right? Yes, exactly. Uh, she's my friend, uh, my friend online, and she she's so cute. And she uh, we did uh, some uh, courses online. Some yeah, yeah, yeah. It's um. It, it's really nice to be able to speak to you. I think we were saying um, recently that you've started um, looking at aesthetic ultrasound use because you focus on the whole body. You, you're a specialist in um, using different radiological techniques, including ultrasound. Um, and facial aesthetics work, I think, is relatively a new topic um, for most practitioners, certainly in the UK. Um, and it's nice to be able to speak to somebody like you, somebody who's got a whole load of knowledge um, to talk to us about ra radiology and ultrasound in particular. Although normally we'd, we'd look at scans involving facial aesthetic treatments tonight, we thought, because of the fantastic work you do, we look at a slightly different area, the skin in particular. Um, you do a lot of work involving ultrasound of skin problems, patients that come um, with different issues. And we thought we'd talk to you a little bit about that. But I, I'll let Sunny um, in, introduce you. I'll let Sunny speak to you first, and um, he can go through your background if that's all right, Mariam. Viv, I was this close to cutting you off. I was this close. <laughs> this close. Um, Mariam, it's, it's really, really great of you to join us. I, I would really, I'm going to keep it very short. Please, um, for everyone that's watching, obviously, I think some of your followers have joined us. You've been following us from almost day one, I think, which is amazing. And we thank you for your support. But for everyone who doesn't know you, please just introduce yourself. Um, your background and your speciality, and then I'll ask you a few questions if that's okay. So please go ahead. Okay, thanks guys. I'm uh, Maria Moli Jaisi. I am professor in radiology from Morocco. Uh, I'm living in uh, uh, Marrakesh, you know? We know Marrakesh? Not been, but we know of Marrakesh, yes. Yes, Marrakech. It's a famous uh, city in Morocco. I think that it's the, the fourth uh, largest uh, city here in Morocco, and it's a famous city. And I'm working in University Hospital Arazi. 
uh, in our department of radiology we did a lot of uh, all uh, all uh, uh, speciality we 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 didn't uh, we didn't uh, do uh, pediatric we didn't do um, breast imaging and uh, particularly me i I, uh, I love MSK. I love musculoskeletic. I do a lot, but um, I love MSK, musculoskeletic, and imagine of sports medicine. Mariam, just out of interest, I'm guessing, do you, because I've watched some of your lives and so on, is French, is French the spoken language, more so the spoken language in, in, um, in Marrakesh, where you're teaching, or is it Moroccan or Arabic, or what, what is it that you generally work, which language do you work with? No, you're uh, you're uh, you're working and you're teaching with French. The the it's the second it's uh, the second language for university. It's French. It's not uh, it's not English. It's not Arabic. Not you are not uh, not teaching in our Arabic. It's very difficult to teach in Arabic. Very difficult difficult in French. Okay. <laughs> in French. A well, lot. Our second language. Well, trivia, trivia. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and I'll stop there. I'll stop there. <laughs> I'll stop there. So, um, what would you, what, just very quickly, what would you prefer to, for us to say? Do you want us to call you Professor because we will, or is it Mariam? What would you prefer? No, no, Mariam. Mariam. Mariam, guys. Okay. Just, I'm okay, a cool good. professor. I'm a cool professor. No, no. <laughs> okay, good. So, Mariam, um, I mean, you obviously have a lot of experience, and when I was uh, very, I, I share your interest in musculoskeletal. It's a very specialised and important, especially in sports medicine. Um, but you, you're now probably seeing as a senior um, radiologist this kind of new exploration of ultrasound with skin. Um, what attracted you to it? What What was the initial thing that triggered your or caught your attention for using ultrasound for a facial aesthetics and skin assessment? Okay, uh, first, uh, just uh, 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 I, I discovered, I discovered uh, ultrasound of skin and aesthetic ultrasound, I think, four or six month, months before. Oh, wow. And okay. was, yes, it, uh, it, I, have, um, I have a friend, it's uh, Dr. Motaki. He's an aesthetic doctor and uh, he, he's doing a filler with, uh, with ultrasound. And he told me, he told me about this. It was, the f for me, it was the first, uh, the first uh, time I'm um, hearing uh, from uh, ultrasound of skin, facial ultrasound. And I, uh, I, I, I began to, to learn and I, I like it and I love it. Why? Because I like, I like musculoskeletic and I did muscles for all body. I did vessels, I did nerves. But it's, uh, I forgot the small thing. It's the skin. <laughs> I, <forgot. laughs> I, for, I think that I forget it, but it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, a good, uh, it's a good way for uh, to examine it. It's, it's uh, fantastic. Uh, I love it. Why? Because uh, certainly we have skin ultrasound, you have aesthetic, and we have tumors, you have surgery, you have a lot of things. And uh, when I, uh, I, I began to learn and to have an idea uh, about it, uh, I, I, I told to myself that uh, I, have, uh, I, have, uh, all the I have a lot of tools and I have the ability because I am a radiologist and I can use uh, ultrasound uh, uh, very, uh, very easy, but I, I don't have a problem to use it. I don't. And when I started to learn, it was very, very easy for, for me. Of course, you're a professor yeah. of radiology, so it should be. It should be. It was very, no, I, I like it. I like it a lot because I, uh, I found that it's, it will be a good thing. And I, uh, I have uh, some, uh, some idea. idea. I, uh, here in Morocco, I think we are just three or four doctors using ultrasound for dermatology, for skin, and for aesthetic. That's amazing. What? Very, one Why? question I had, one question I remember had, how, how big is facial aesthetics in um, Morocco? Is it, is it something that is commonly done or people commonly have treatments or is it something that's still relatively new? 
No, no, no. We have a lot of things uh, to do in. Uh, no, no. It's it's, it's uh, very common. Have, uh, yes, yes. We have a lot of. Uh, we have a lot of uh, uh, filler. Uh, a lot of aesthetic uh, doctor, uh, aesthetic surgeon. Uh, a lot of. No, no. We 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 did um, it here. Uh, Morocco. We did it here in Morocco, and I think another thing that's not I think it's reality. This technique, uh, ultrasound, facial ultrasound, facial skin, it's not a French ways. It's uh, uh, it's a no, it's Brazilian, it's Argentine, it's uh, Aus uh, 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 Austria too, and the uh, United United Kingdom, Netherlands, uh, Germany. I think, but not French. I don't know why. Oh, wow, that's interesting. That's interesting. Do you, um, is this, I mean, do you, do you do any, have you done any facial aesthetics work yourself? Is that something that you'd be interested in now that you've got, you're examining the skin and you can, you can, you understand, obviously you have a better understanding of the imaging that's involved. Is this something that you'd potentially go into yourself? Uh, to do in myself, I don't. Uh... Oh, no, not for yourself. Not as in, as in injecting other people or treating other people. You don't need it. For... Marry you don't need it. For, for my why not why not uh, you are uh, or skin or skin pharma <laughs> why not no yes uh, actually i'm i'm uh, i'm i'm busy i'm i'm focused to uh, have a lot of knowledge and a lot of things to learn anatomy first and uh, to learn uh, and to learn and to practice a lot uh, ultrasound facial ultrasound facial dermatology and uh, after i will uh, i want i want to give a course yeah. why not uh, multidisciplinary courses for example we do here in marrakesh we have the radiologist we have the surgeon we have the uh, aesthetic medicine and uh, to to uh, to work for example, I will give uh, what is a normal ultrasound for a temporary region, for example, and after uh, you will do the, the injection. I don't know if uh, after I, I will do it. I don't know. I, uh, wow. But I, I'm, I'm, uh, why not? Why not? Right now? Interesting. Right now, Yes, right I'm now. Gonna hand over to, I'm going to hand over to Viv because Viv has got some questions about research and I think he's going to start talking about some of the slides and pictures that you've shared with him. So Viv, yeah, yeah. over to you. Yeah, th th thanks, um, thanks Mar Mariam, uh, about telling us about your background. Um, in terms of work, research work, you do lots of in, um, involved work with ultrasound and with radiology. What current research are you doing? What sort of work are you interested in right now, research work? Uh, on research work, I'm focused in musculoskeletic first, after I did a lot, uh, I did uh, I did uh, um, uh, city of lang 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 imagine and thyroid thyroid imagine by ultrasound. Um, um, yeah. Right now, I'm 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 focused on this three uh, three uh, speciality, but I I I I, uh, I I I like and I did. And I'm doing a lot, a lot of things about uh, about uh, teaching, teach, multimedia teaching kit. I sent it to you uh, yesterday. Yes. About yeah. for example, I, I I want just to uh, to 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 take, for example, I uh, to take cyst uh, uh, lesion around knee, and yeah. uh, to do some uh, multimedia uh, learning and teaching kit for students, for, yeah. for doctors, for residents uh, in radiology. Yes, yes. I'll show, I'll show the, this is um, some online e-learning work that you're involved in. Yes, it's And it's, it's a, tell, us, tell us a little bit more about the e-learning, the, um, the work you do online, uh, Mariam. Yes, I I I I, I thought I, I think that I did the ten uh, ten uh, ten multimedia teaching right now. I did it yeah. with, uh, with students, with students, with students. Mm -hmm. Our department in radiology. I like uh, doing this uh, for uh, for students. Yeah. Okay. What about the future? Do you plan perhaps on um, teaching um, ultrasound use and aesthetics work? Do you think perhaps in the future you'll do that? Uh, it, I thought like it will be a surprise for you. Right now, I'm, <laughs> working, I'm working. I'm working with the 
uh, with uh, Dr. Uh, Mobin from uh, Austria. Right, yeah. Uh, you know what? My students, I have my, uh, one of my students is uh, living there. And right. <laughs> it's very, uh, and uh, she's, uh, she was uh, looking for, uh, for a subject for the thesis. And I, I told that, you know, there is some radiologist doing good fashion and I want to do uh, multimedia uh, learning, uh, multimedia learning kit for fashion, just to begin. Yeah. And if you want, you can, uh, you can do it with your CG. Okay, we will. <laughs> because it's, it's something like that, but I'm not very, uh, very good in... Uh, uh, in informatic, in the call. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure you're. I'm sure you're not bad at all. I'm sure you're not bad at all. But um, was there anything you wanted to say, Sonny? Um, I was just gonna. So some of the one of the questions I had because I saw some of the slides and the work that you've done, Mariam, and obviously um, Viv had shared some of the slides that you sent in. One of the what is it that you are finding different? when you're scanning, for example, as a basal cell carcinoma or sound scan or, or um, skin tumors, what, what value is ultrasound adding to ultrasound. that? When, yeah. you know, what is it adding to the kind of, ma is it adding to the management? Is it adding to the diagnosis? What is it adding for you as a clinician when yeah. you're scanning? Uh, the first, uh, the, the patient, the patient, I, I, uh, uh, I I'm working with the, with the department of dermatology and I'm working with the department of uh, reconstructive chirurgy and I, I, I took my, uh, my, uh, my ultrasound. It's a good thing. It's a, it's a good thing, yeah. I haven't got yeah. my ultrasound at home, but yeah, I feel left out. Oh, we lost you there for a second. A lot of... Um, I have, uh, there you go. I, 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 I will show you the Moroccan ultrasound. I have it here. Yeah. Yeah. Have Moroccan yes, product. It's Vital Scan. It's Vital Scan. I have two. Huh? Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> with, with with profound probe and superficial probe. Wow. And does that is that portable as well, or does that connect to um, a bigger? Yes, it's connects to uh, to Android. Yes, it's like Larry. Okay. It's like, oh wow, okay. okay. Yes, but nice. pure uh, Moroccan production. It's Vital oh, Scan. Wow. Oh, this is a Moroccan, this is a Moroccan made ultrasound scan. Vital Scan, it's Moroccan uh, production. It's Moroccan production. Oh wow. 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 Amazing. I think, it's just... uh, yeah, go on, go on. Viv, I can tell you, your eyes are... No, no. <laughs> Leone, Leone Schalke, Dr. Leone Schalke. I'm sure you know her well, uh, Mariam. She's watching. I think she's having some problems connecting. I think other people are connecting okay. So it might be just possibly a temporary glitch um, that Leone's got. Leone, don't worry. You'll be able to watch this fully afterwards once we once we've finished anyway. But um, do, do you... Do you I, I, yeah. I love it. I want to I wanna one day be in, uh, in courses with Leone. Yeah, well, she, um, she, she loves watching the lives and she's watching um, this live. She's ah. interested in what you're saying, Mariam. Um, what about other practitioners? Do you get on well with other practitioners around the world, with other radiologists and other aesthetic practitioners, perhaps? Uh, just, I think just uh, right now, uh, for modern. Uh, he is radiologist and he did a lot of uh, MRI, by the way. He did a lot of MRI for filler. Uh, yeah, yeah. Did you, did you see the, the, the last, uh, the last uh, article of Dr. Mob Mobin? No, but we will I... look it up. We will look it up. Yes, look, look, I've seen some earlier work that he's done. For look, her, look. Uh, MRI, uh, Ka Carolina, Carolina, because we, yeah. have, um, we have the same address. Because, uh, she did, uh, Carol, she did a lot of uh, musculoskeletal imaging, uh, musculoskeletal uh, disease, and uh, a mother doctor, I forgot, I forgot uh, the, the name, I'm so sorry, she is also from, I thought from Brazil, she is also... Uh, oh, Rosa, Rosa Seagrist. Exactly, yeah. Rosa, yeah, we know Rosa. Yeah. <laughs> One of the things I wanted to ask you, Mariam, and um, somebody's mentioning it in a question just below. Um, 
tell us tell us a little bit about your mind talk webinars that you'll be doing over the next few months i think people want to know what you'll be doing in those webinars okay about the mind talk it's uh, it's midre you know midre ultrasound minute here in our department we have school medicine of ultrasound in our part by midre right yeah so does your does your webinars they start next week is that right they'll be starting next week next next week and uh, we 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 do a lot of webinar with uh, with uh, with mindre about uh, about uh, musculoskeletal imaging about thyroid about ultrasound about yeah. ultrasound but it's not ultrasound for, for example when I, i'm talking uh, i will talk next uh, next uh, week uh, about um, i will talk i don't know exactly it's uh, m m imagine uh, if uh, m m masses uh, soft uh, soft tissue masses and i'm yeah. about the all problem because yeah. we have patient, we have a patient we have the history of patient we have a background of patient we have a scan ultrasound of the mass but we can do after mri we can do ct or mri and we discuss the the whole problem masses yeah. i i like to to give a talk uh, about all all thing yes we have ultrasound but we have a limit yeah yeah That's a, that's a, oh sorry go on Ruth. I was going to say no, that's, no, really, no. that's a really good point because from because obviously MRI is, and CT are always classified as gold standard aren't they but then we have this imaging tool in clinic which can be almost a bedside tool which that, um, that is a really interesting point about what are the limitations are there limitations and, and can it help with diagnosing patients quicker doing more in clinic you know treatments and biopsies and you know miss it and and identifying the limits of a mass and so on i mean that's really exciting use of portable ultrasound um i mean that i mean what, are you going to is that part of the university that you'll be doing that mariam or is this going to be open to the public as well uh i don't uh, i don't uh, oh so it, will it will would these webinars just be for your university students or will it be for everyone all uh, 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 it's uh, all the world Oh, um, where, what will you be doing? Oh, the world. Okay, so, so we, we, I mean, we'd like to share that. So will you be doing it from your Instagram or will you be doing it from a platform? Zoom. I will send you the Zoom. Zoom, yeah, Zoom. So I think it's um, organised via Zoom and people can just um, sign up to join with you. Is that right, Mariam? Yes, yes, yes. Maybe you yeah. could um, send one of us the link and I'm sure people will be will, really interested. Will, yeah. send, uh, will it be in French or English? And now it will be in it will be in French. My 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 uh, my English. It's I'm not very fluent. In oh, it's it's better than our French. It's better than our French, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was I was going to talk a little bit just about some of the scans that you've done on the skin, Mariam. Some of the posts that you've made. I'll show some of these, and you can talk about them just so people can understand what they're seeing. So this is um. A basal cell carcinoma scan. I was amazed when I saw this. I didn't even think it was possible to detect a problem like this with ultrasound. T tell us a little bit about it, Mariam. Okay, uh, when we have uh, when we have tumors of skin, ultrasound uh, can uh, of, uh, they can't uh, um, uh, give diagnosis of tumors and to the. Yeah. The, the differentiation between melon, melanoma or not melanoma. And here, what we are seeing, we have a lot of hyperchoic uh, things. You have a dot sign. Uh, it's uh, it's uh, it's uh, uh, it's uh, basal cell carcinoma, carcinoma, high level of malignity. Right. Okay. But, yeah. Uh, no. In melanoma, in melanoma, you don't have this hyperchoic on tumors wow okay i mean really i've got good. another got another one this is um discoid lupus um a scan it's just a photo a still image um but again you could these um discoid areas is the are these the areas that that show that problem maria 
No, the problem the problem is in uh, in uh, the problem is in the uh, in the, in dermis. You have a chip right. in dermis. Yeah. You have vascular vas uh, Doppler flow. Uh, blood. So the, it's the it's the vascularity in the dermis that gives you the clue to the right. diagnosis. Is that right? Right. And you have uh, and you have hypo echoic hypo echoic in yes. there. It's, wow. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's a discoid lupus with vascular with the edema and vascularization. Right. Uh, I will I will uh, I will tell you uh, something. I uh, I uh, uh, I'm in the department of Dema dermatology with yeah. with my portable scan, and I I called uh, I called the residents the the and I did scan. In the department of dermatology, not in radiology. Oh wow! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is this this is one more. It was just skin tumors again. Um, tumors. Assess, assessment of skin tumors using ultrasound. Yes, it's a big skin tumors. I forgot what is it. Uh, uh, skin, yes, skin. Marion, is that is that and, and that vascularity within the tumor? Yes. That's that's is that characteristic of the tumor itself? The tropical region, and we have the tropical vessel. It's yes. a tropical vessel, and here it's very important for surgeon. Uh, we will give, we will give uh, the the real muse, muse, the real the real thickness, the real localization, and he, uh, here we are. Uh, here we are, uh, tropical vessel, and we have the respect of fascia and the muscles. Yeah, right. You can see it. You can see it. Yeah. yeah. Especially the vascularity. Were these images were these images taken with the clarius, or were they taken with? Clarius. Take with it the with Wow. Amazing. There's there's one more there's one more image. Um, it's a temporal flap. So there's some there's some uh, skin uh, appearance where the surgery is being carried out. So if anyone doesn't like cuts, just avoid watching this. But this is just a still image. Um, let me just get it up. It's one. Oh, of, yes, it's one so of that, the famous. That, uh, yeah, and because this patient, I will send you the the first image. It's uh, uh, the patient has a big tumors, big tumors of uh, emifacial, emifacial, and right. uh, he did a lot of uh, chirurgery. And at last, for reconstructive chirurgery, the surgeon he is, by the way, uh, my, my my one of my best friends forever. Uh, he, he he did a flap, a topperl flap, uh, in mandible region yeah. here. He took from topperl, exactly. He took it from topperl. Uh, when when they took when they took the flap, we have uh, topperl vessels. And yeah. when I did uh, where I did uh, the ultrasound, when I scan it, here we have the flap, echogenesis in normal and. We have the vessels, normal vascular, vascular. So that, Mariam, that is, a, that is an amazing insight yeah. because actually, for the tissue viability and the healing process, you can you can train or nurses to, basic or whoever's looking at tissue viability, you're basically saying that you can look at the vascularity using the ultrasound and actually look to see how well this is actually healing. Amazing insight, absolutely. This yeah. is what this is what this is about. I mean that. I, I mean that's just. But that was amazing. I, I forgot I forgot forgot it and I sent I sent it uh, yesterday I, I think. You did. You, I, I, I've never seen scans like this. Certainly not with a with a portable ultrasound scanner. How how it, it's just amazing what you're doing, Mariam. I think I, I'm just shocked at what I mean, can that, be done. The application there, which you just said, is that if you know if every tissue viability for, for example in aesthetics where we have um where we have necrosis but and we want to see vascularity improve Actually. on a daily basis you can be measuring this vascularity and sometimes yeah. absolutely that, that insight marion is just absolutely do you, great do you, do you think research in future looking at potential you know vascular occlusion problems in the face marion do you think looking at the um the blood flow, the vascularity following um, occlusion, do you think that's likely to help assess how well treatment is being carried out? The occlusion treatment, blocking, re removing the blockage with high layers? Yes, I think that it will be a good thing. If you did, uh, if you did, uh, if you did filler with 
it's safety for patient. It's for uh, safety first. I like this safety first, and I think that don't have the problem after. But when we are doing this, and we are and we are uh, uh, we are uh, we are putting the needle in the vessels and the vessels after we we will uh, do a lot of things. I think we'll. When we did Etrasson, I think that's the the it it will we will, we will don't have a lot of complication. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 it does it minimizes the risk. Yeah. And and we, and we have it. We will be the diagnostic uh, before, and we will treat it. And we don't have. Amazing. Amazing, amazing. I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm just still amazed at the different types of skin issues you're detecting with the ultrasound. I'm just, when I saw the basal cell carcinoma scan a few um, within the last couple of weeks, I was just shocked. I honestly couldn't believe you were picking up um, issues using ultrasound um, like that. So I've got to, I've got to thank you for your post. I hope you do more posts like that on your Instagram, Marian, because they're really interesting for for practitioners like us who deal with skin. Um, but it's more related to ultrasound, ultrasound and aesthetic work. But uh, looking at the problems you see and how you assess them, it's just amazing. I think. Um, what what do you what do you reckon, Sonny? I, I've looked at Marian's uh, Instagram, and I think Marian, if you can continue to post. Yeah, insights and things like that it's amazing and, and anyone who's watching who i think a lot of your followers are actually it's your yeah. followers that are following us tonight and a lot of your yeah. students are <laughs> very very happy it's uh, all students all doctors dermatology here yeah please yeah. If, do follow i think we are on our good standard of time so yeah. Viv, i'll let you wrap up I'll let you wrap up. yeah just wanted to thank you a lot for joining us tonight mary really kind of you and to give your knowledge um, to uh, practitioners like us and people watching, it's really, really fantastic. And we've got to thank you for doing that. Um, just to really sum up, in the future, what do you think, um, how do you think ultrasound will progress in helping practitioners who carry out ultras who carry out aesthetic treatments? Do you think there's a big future um, for the use of ultrasound in aesthetics work? Um, in the UK, in Morocco, around the world, what do you think of that? I think that it will be a daily practice. Wow! Yeah, yeah I think that, uh, it will be a daily practice, and I think that uh, uh, as a radiologist, as uh, aesthetic doctors doing uh, doing uh, 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 injection with ultrasound i think that uh, we have to we, we have to, to 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 do courses and we have uh, to, um, to 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 learn more to practice more and for uh, for doctor anatomy is the key anatomy is the key before doing ultrasound we have we have to have anatomy in our mind or our brain and after ultrasound anatomy scan anatomy scan normal ultrasound do it a lot why not do it like this i i i did it i did it all the time for me for my children for my just uh, to practice to practice to practice and to learn and we have to to do it on academic ways yes if right now right now a lot of a lot of per person doing injection, and this person they aren't doctors. Mm. Yeah. All, all the world person uh, doing injection. I don't know uh, Turkish or something like that. And here in Morocco, we don't have an idea about uh, about the product. Yeah. And yeah. I think that with ultrasound we can diagnose the type of product the product and uh, i think that we, we we have to stop this uh, this uh, this this thing this uh, it's a medical it's a medical uh, medical uh, things it's a medical dance and we have to do it with uh, with uh, professional yeah. yes yeah. marion that, that is amazingly said thank you so much thank you so much thank yeah. you guys thanks very much 
I'll just I'll just finish off, Marion. We've just next week we've got next Sunday, eleventh of September, we've got Dr. Steve Stephen Weiner from Florida, who's a facial plastic surgeon. He does lots of work with ultrasound. I'm sure you know him very well. Um, and he'll be joining us at 7 p.m. on Sunday, the 11th of September. So hope hope we get plenty of people watching. I hope you join us as well to watch it, uh, Marion. Thanks, guys. Have a good Thank day. you. Thank you. Brilliant, Marion. Thank you. Thanks, Viv. Thanks, Thanks a lot. See you, Marion. See you, Sonny.